guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna be doing a nursery tour for you guys of the twins room. So I've been so excited to make this video. So here it is. You can see through the bars here. So then we just went and had and ordered another one when we found out we were having twins. Um, so this one will be for the girl and this one will be for the boy. Um, we have the names picked out, but um, we're not sharing them yet because we're still seeing if we if, we're, if they're gonna stick. But their names will go up here like this. So I will be showing that to you guys in a later video to come. So moving on to inside of their cribs, um, I just bought these sheets from Target. Um, this one has little trees on it and like little tiny squirrels and deer, rabbits. And then for the boy, I also bought these at Target and these ones have little trees and mountains. So their theme is kind of like woodland, aztec -y, sort of. <laughs> uh, it's a light theme because with boy and girl, I didn't really know what to do. So um, these, this is a um, a snuggle me organic, um, and you just place the baby in it here, and it kind of snuggles them. And um, they're super cute. I put this cover on it. It's actually a sheet cover for um, like a pack and play. But here's how it looks like without it. So this is also a cover I think that it comes with. But yeah, Snuggle Me Organic. I love this. I think it's better than the Daca Talk because this one actually will hold them in place. So it's really good for when they're really little. And of course they can grow and keep using it as well. We just have some cute little um, loveys over here super cute and for the little boy he also has a snuggle me organic super soft and he has a levy and a little stuffed hippo super cute I am obsessed oh yes um this is a mesh covering that um, I found on Amazon and I used it for Liam and I really loved it it's really breathable, but it doesn't allow them to slip their little feet and legs through the cracks and get caught. So I just got another one. So this little mobile I made from flowers and I just kind of put them around on this like little wooden ring and it looks so cute. And I did the same for the boy, but just no pink flowers. Um, sorry, I'm like really dark, but these curtains we actually purchased from Amazon and I love them. They have little leaf patterns on them and they're really sheer. And I'm not gonna do blackout curtains as of right now because I have this and it can get pretty dark um, if you just twist the blinds. So I'm not gonna be getting blackout curtains unless I see that it's a problem. So moving on over to the changing table. This was Liam's old changing um, pad and we just changed out to this little pattern with gray and pink arrows on it. And then we have a couple more that I'll be using. This picture frame won't be staying here. It's just there right now. 
So this is just a regular dresser um, that we bought on Amazon like when we were getting ready for Liam's nursery. And then I just wanted to freshen it up so I changed out the knobs for little glass um, handles and I love it. It kind of makes it feel like a new dresser to me. So inside this top drawer, I have their little diapers. These are the cutest diapers, guys. Oh my gosh, look at this. It's preemie size. So we have a couple diapers in preemie size because twins, they might end up being quite small. And then we have size number one diapers. But yeah, that is crazy. Here we just have this little snotty thing, which I don't like this. I think I'm actually going to get the nose Frida. But for now, it's there. And then um, we have two little um, booties for them to wear. This is empty except for this little tie that I found. So I'm going to try to put little accessories for the boy in there. And then this has some bows and um, headbands for the girl. So the second drawer has all the little boy clothes. These are zero to three months uh, onesies. This is a little swaddle me um i'm gonna put them in this for bed and he has so many clothes because i bought some new clothes for him but he also has all of liam's clothes to wear so for the girl she doesn't have as much stuff yet but i'm sure that will change <laughs> but these are all her onesies um zero to three months these are all her little pants um so cute this is like a little outfit and she also has a swaddle and some of her night clothes. And in the last drawer, this is just a bunch of um, burp rags and they are, we use them with Liam so much. So I hope this is enough for the twins. And then over here, we just have some bibs and then a couple more swaddles for the boy. Behind the boy's crib, I also store uh, my bobby pillow and my best friend pillow, and these are for singles, but I might be nursing or feeding them one at a time, so they'll probably come in use. So this rug I purchased on Amazon. I absolutely love it. I think it's really chill, and I just like it a lot. And it was pretty inexpensive, so that's awesome. Over here is their rocker, and I just got a little glider from Amazon. This was actually Liam's um, glider. It has this kind of pattern on it. It's like a gray zigzag pattern. Um, I didn't really want that for this room, so I covered it up with a blanket. Um, I got this pillow at TJ Maxx. I ordered this little fur on um, Amazon and it's actually going to be for their photo shoot uh, because I'm going to be doing the photo shoot myself. Since I do photography, I might as well take advantage of that. And then behind um, their rocking chair, I store this ginormous twinsy pillow. <laughs> This thing is huge, look at it. But people swear by this. You can put them inside and feed them. You can wear it and nurse them. Um, you can stick them in there. I mean, and I actually got this on a really good deal. Um, a lady was selling this. She just had twins and she didn't need it anymore. So she sold it to me for $75 and usually this is like, um, I think it's like $150 or something like that. I don't know. It's, it's a lot of money. But anyways, and I got it in cream, which is awesome because I only have been seeing them in green and I hate green for like pillows and stuff. So it's just, <laughs> I'm so happy that we found it. Uh, down here in this basket, I just have a bunch of, Okay, so these are like things that they're going to wear for their photo shoot. So I have swaddles for them that they're going to be wearing. Gray, two, two tan, one gray, and it's kind of like a maroon. Um, little hats with matching little bears. They have, uh, this is an elephant outfit. I'll show you. An outfit, I picked this up at Target. Super cute. This is a little unicorn 
um, outfit that they'll be that she will be wearing. So I just thought that was kind of cute. So I'm excited to do their photo shoot. Can't wait. Um, over here, this is a Mamaru, and I actually got this on a deal too. Usually they're like two nineteen or something like that. Like, um, but I got this for seventy five dollars off of Facebook Market. Yes, for the win. And um, so I I could have bought two of these. The lady was selling two, but I did, I already have another swing with from Liam, so I decided to just to get this one. Um, and I don't even know if they're gonna like it, so I just I thought I'd just get one. And if I really if they love it, then I'll get the other one. So this is the diaper pail that I've been using for the last two years. Um, I would say it's pretty good at keeping the smell out. Um, you just step here and this pops open and then you can um, put the diapers in there and it closes and then it closes up. Um, now there are special bags for this, but I just use regular trash bags because I don't have the time for that or the money. Um, up above the door, they have this little sign and it says, two little blessings from above, twice the smiles, twice the love. And I made that for them to hang above their door because I thought it was so cute. And then over here, we have their hamper. And um, I bought this from Amazon for, I think it was like $15, but it was really cheap. But I like it because it, um, it kind of has that that vibe of like tribal, like it's a teepee of some kind, I don't know. <laughs> Above their closet, I made this little um, banner for them, which is super cute. Has the same tribal print as the teepees. And over here on this wall, we have like a little, um, little gallery, just uh, some arrows, a little raccoon, be brave, I'll be in my teepee. I got all of these um, wall decorations from Hobby Lobby. Best place on earth. So moving on to the closet. Uh, we have some boy clothes over here, some girl clothes over here. Um, so these are all the girl clothes over here. So cute, look how cute. These are clothes that are three to six months and some six months, some pajamas, um, a little matching outfit for the, for this is for the girl and then a matching outfit. This one's the boys, they're from Baby Gap. Look how cute this little tiny, oh my gosh, I'll have to show you. Look how cute this is, so adorable. And then a bunch of Liam's clothes that he wore a couple times, but then, you know, they grow out of it, so I'm so happy that another little boy is going to be wearing them because they're so cute. Little boy clothes are just the cutest. Look at this Ralph Lauren. Oh, so cute. Um, I have three baskets. Um, and this basket, oh, every time I do that, something is wrong. <laughs> In this basket, we're keeping swaddles. Um, and this, this basket over here, I'm keeping um, just some outfits that are gender neutral or matching outfits for them to wear. This is just full of kind of matching outfits. So this is um, new to the tribe and I have two of those because those are gender neutral so they can both wear those. And here are some zebra printed ones. They can both wear those. and then. This is just a bunch of gender neutral clothes in my opinion. Like the girl could wear this, the boy could wear this, um, lots of grays and whites. Um, so that's kind of where this basket's at. In this basket I have, I have Advent bottles that I'm gonna use for them. I have just this little bottle um, thing. And we have another one of these, a drying rack for the bottle, but who knows, maybe this one will work just as well. Advent um, bottle warmer because I had the Dr. Brown's bottle warmer with Liam and I absolutely hate it. I mean, it works really well, but it gets like, it's, you can't even clean it. It's so hard to clean and it starts to smell and then like you can't even take the filter off. It's so annoying. Deciding to use these bottles. I only bought a little bit because I have to see if they work. I have been using the Medilla and the um, Dr. Brown's bottles, but they have so many parts and with twins, I just doubt that I'm going to be able to handle it. 
if I can avoid washing all those little stupid parts, I'm gonna avoid it, so. Up here, this is just full of their toys. The This basket has um, their carrier, so I have the Bobo carrier, and I have the Baby Born carrier. Love, love, love this carrier. Love both of them, really. So we have two of those. In this basket, I have all of their hats, both boy and girl hats. Um, and then I just have some extra clothes for the boy that are all about like six month and up clothes. So he will be using that later. Um, in this drawer, I have my breast pump. I have the Medela uh, breast pump. And it's, it worked really well last time, so fingers crossed it'll work this time. And this is basically empty. I just, I'm keeping the box of that hatch thing, just in case. Over here, I'm keeping bottles. And then these are all the bottles that I had with Liam. They're Med the Medilla bottles. Um, so I have them inside here, inside of a box. Why do I have that now? So they're all like this, and I, they're all clean. And they're just waiting to go. I also have the breast pump parts. Here in the bottom, I have this box is full of baby toys, shoes, it's a shoe box, full of old shoes, um, only for the boy though, so we'll have to get girl shoes. And in this um, little drawer, I have more baby toys. So these are the rockin' plays that are probably gonna go in my room or anywhere around the house. They are the auto rocker ones, so they rock on their own. So we're probably gonna have them sleep in here for their naps, um, maybe even bedtime, if I see that they sleep better in this. Um, if not, they're gonna sleep in the Snuggle Me Organics inside of the, the little pack and play I have um, by my bed. And if that doesn't work, or if one of them has like acid reflux, then they will sleep in these by my bed. So in the bathroom that is next to both Liam's and the twins' room, I have all their stuff here. This is just towels. Um, these are baby blankets. This is a little thing for the store to put on the shopping cart. Um, and in these baskets, I have sheets here, towels and washcloths and towels and a whole bunch of diapers. Just um, newborn diapers, number one diapers, number two. So tons of them, and we will be getting more and more of these, I'm sure. So that's it for the nursery tour. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I really had so much fun putting this room together and making this video. Um, if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Thank you.